What's going on guys? It's Mike Gray. Welcome to the channel. What's good with it y'all? We are back with another one. Y'all may recognize this spot. This is my favorite studio, y'all already know. About to shoot the homie Jacob, who y'all may know from the Wendell Scott video. Of course, I got it on me. I got it on me though, so don't worry about that. I was on the east side, but I did have it on me. That Pentax 6-7, but we are gonna be shooting with the Olympus Stylus Epic point and shoot. We're gonna hit the streets of downtown after this once we are done shooting in here. They were getting on me last time for my shadows. So I'll make sure in this video that uh, that none of my none of my shadows are on, are on the pictures. Oh, okay, five six at one twenty fifth. I'm gonna shoot box speed. You know what I'm saying? We are gonna shoot box speed today. All right. There my shadow is. Uh. My shadow. Y'all was talking that good shit about my shadow, so I'm very cognizant of them right now. Any dude that crosses their legs like that, like that's some boss shit. Like, <laughs> that's money, that's the money pose. Did you know that, Jacob? No, I didn't. Yeah, that's, that's the money pose, especially dressed like that too. That money is coming, it's on the way. Hey, I mean, that's good. Can you turn your head a little bit more? There you go, yeah. Fire, perfect, hold that. That's a dope one. I kind of like that, that laugh that you had. Right. So, so come on, can you, are you good with fake laughs? Um, yeah, sure. All right, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there, there's, there's a laugh. Hold on, lean back a little bit. <laughs> Eyes closed. <laughs> That's that I'm enjoying life, I just got that check laugh. <laughs> now, we're about to pull out the point and shoot. So, we're gonna keep him right there. The Olympus Stylus Epic 35 millimeter point and shoot camera. Okay, you, we latch it like this. You close it. So we ready to go. We're on the first frame. You ready? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember I shot somebody and this is all I brought. It was just a test shoot, which is why it wasn't documented. And they were like, oh, where's your other camera? <laughs> I said, I didn't bring that shit. This is all we working with, the Olympus Stylus Epic. And surprisingly, I know back in the day you could get these for like maybe $40, $50. This camera cost me almost $300, overpriced. So I really want to give it an honest shot right now on him to see how the images come out compared to the Pentax. Oh, you can hear the wind? Okay. Well, we, we, get, we getting away. It's time to shoot now. Let's get, let's, let's, let's shoot. Got him in the new look. Fly, you know what I'm saying? Nike blazers. Got the cardigan, got the tee, got the Kanye gold. You know what I'm saying? It's official. streets of downtown Los Angeles and there is a really famous tunnel under a freeway where sun comes through the freeway gaps and you can you know we could take some dope pictures now this famous freeway was in the movie the soloist and um, we saw it on the way here but I'm trying to remember the route that we took to get here which definitely wasn't this street Man, right why here they doing that box shit? What box? Oh, it's just covering my face. It's, right. it's, it's just keeping focus. Like you need to move. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, thank you, <laughs> thank you, thank you. We're gonna try to find this location without getting in an accident, and then uh, we'll tap back in once we get there. Mm -hmm. 
We have made it. We found the soloist tunnel. Mr. Lopez would come in here. Mr. Lopez, you know, Mr. Lopez, don't I, don't touch my violin, Mr. Lopez. That that happened like right over there. Like, it's, it's legit homeless people over here, but I really like this vibe. So come on, Jacob. So I loaded up some Tri-X 400 in both. So we only shooting black and white at this location because none of it, well, the bag don't match with what he got on. So the bag, the bag do not match. It don't, it just don't match, but we gonna make it happen. And uh, yeah, let's, 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 let's get some photos, man. Let's get some photos. My eyes be playing, my eyes are so bad. Like my eyes be playing mad tricks. I got to blink. If you got really bad eyes, I'm wearing contacts, just blink and then look back into the frame, there you go. Graham, you, you, you do music? Yeah, yeah. All right, what's your shit? Big Homie Lipe, Big Homie. Uh-huh. L-I-P-E. L-I-P-E. Then put a two. Two, boom, yeah. got you. Yeah. Bet. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, so that's the thing about LA. You never know who you're gonna meet. Damn, I wasn't even recording that. I'm just playing, bro. <laughs> why, why, why are you upset? You was getting your you were doing. You were doing what? I was texting my people. You, my what? people. You were. Why are you in my face? <laughs> you were texting your people. Bro, he <laughs> put up a picture right now of DJ Drama in this side by side. Side by side, don't he? That's crazy. He do look like DJ Drama because DJ Especially Drama be, be wearing the same exact thing like yeah. That. <laughs> show. Show. Hey, but this shows the versatility though. Yeah. You, know. you know what I'm saying? All right. See what bro had on earlier. You would have never guessed. <laughs> 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 like pull each side, look down. Yeah, hold that. Shouts out to Braden at Film Supply Club though for selling me this. Even though you got the camera low and it's going under my chin and it's fine. <laughs> you don't you don't got the arm muscles then it's fine. You hear that? You hear that? That means that that means that this camera is done. The film is complete. They just be wanting to take pictures of their cars, bro. This ain't Atlanta. This this dude Julian think everybody trying to rob us, bro. Come on, man. I'm not thinking hey, about that. Rob us. My voice in the video of somebody getting robbed down here the other day. Down here? Yeah, downtown. Not here. This exactly somebody like gunpoint? Yeah. Like it was all on video? Yeah. Well, maybe we can get robbed down here then. <laughs> the tea of the night tonight is that good old chamomile tea. It's been a very busy week. As Tuesday, I have my official surgery on my septum. So, um, pretty thrilled and excited about that. Nah, I'm not. This is a bit too hot, so I'm gonna set it down. And if you guys aren't too familiar with the benefits of chamomile tea, it's gonna put me night-night. Once I'm done editing this, I'm, I'm going right night-night. Let's start with this, because y'all already know about this. The Olympus Stylus Epic Point and Shoot Camera. 35 millimeter, is it overpriced? Absolutely. Am I a fan? I'll use this camera to take pictures of moments in life. So when I'm with family, at the family reunion, the family barbecue, documenting things on the fly. I think I did myself a disservice by hopping into the photography game, going straight to medium format. It's a certain expectation that I'm used to capturing when it comes to quality of my images. And it's not to say that having grain decreases the quality of a photo because I've taken photos on plenty medium format film cameras and I have gotten grain, which I love. It adds character to the image. But even then, I'll purchase a 35 millimeter SLR and throw a flash on the top of it instead of this. But I, I understand, which is the reason why, even though this video was based around that camera, 
yeah, the Pentax one. The Pentax shitted all over the point and shoot, in my opinion. Though we got some pretty cool photos with the point and shoot. Uh, yeah, that's the reason why I used about four of the point and shoot <laughs> images and the rest were from the Pentax. I figured that would happen, but I figured I'd give it a shot. I don't do enough of these type of videos and I really enjoyed myself and had fun with this one because there was no expectation. My homie Jacob just wanted some photos and we knew we would take photos, but I really didn't plan a concept. We didn't have a concept. We didn't plan. Literally the only thing he sent me was the fits that he wanted the photos in. And I thought, okay, well, we could start off at the studio so we can get some, you know, cool portraits and just some in-studio natural light shots. Can't go wrong with those. And then we hit downtown and uh, we found the soloist spot, which was sick, and just took some pictures there. And for me, this was awesome because I just had such a great time interacting with my homies going out in the field taking some dope pictures having some great conversation meeting new people and that's a part of photography that's super important and super vital and i'd encourage a lot of people to not put too much pressure on themselves you know for a shoot sometimes it's good to go out shoot with no expectation and you'd be surprised with some of the images that you get um, i know for myself i plan and i I will, of course, y'all already know my style of photography. I choose a concept, I dress the life, I dress the surrounding areas and the location, and those I will always do. But this was kind of like a practice go. This is kind of like, like practice for me. Shouts outs to you, Jacob, for killing it, AKA DJ Drama. Would I spend another $300 on this camera if I lost this? Probably not. I think for me, my setup, which would be similar to this, is just getting a fire ass 35 millimeter SLR camera and throwing a sick flash on top. I think that would give me more of the feel and the quality that I'm looking for. Aside from the point and shoot, this camera is super dope and maybe I'll like give it to my sister or something and she can take some cool little vintage looking pictures of her and her friends, I don't know. But um, I'm, I'm glad I got to try it out. You know, you gotta, you, you can't knock it until you try, right? <laughs> but anyways, man, I appreciate y'all so much for watching. We are now at 13K. Like the video if you rocked with it. Subscribe to the channel. I need y'all, man. I appreciate y'all. And if you're watching the videos and you're not a part of the family, come on, join the family. If you are familiar with some wonderful 35 millimeter point and shoot cameras, I'd love to hear your responses and yeah, I thank you guys again for watching. I see y'all next week. We out. <laughs>